Lancashire gave a tumultuous welcome to the King and Queen when they paid surprise visits to a dozen or so textile towns and war centres. Outstanding memory of the two-day tour is of thousands of children cheering in every town along the hundred-mile route. This welfare centre youngster seems to be busy on post-war house building, with a little more success than his elders. Wounded men, as always, received a big part of their Majesty's time. During these two days, the King and Queen met and talked to men from every battlefront, including some recently brought back to England after rescue from a Japanese prison camp. Their Majesties showed special interest in the newest methods of occupational therapy and rehabilitation designed to restore damaged limbs and minds to maximum usefulness. Nursing profession, a silently devoted service, working long hours for little pay. Care of the wounded, hospital and child welfare work go on here in one of Britain's most highly industrialised areas. No royal visit has been greeted with such tremendous enthusiasm since the coronation. Lancashire will long remember it.